Hey, what's going on guys? It's Keda here and many times you need some power supply in a remote location so you can use these uh, big chunky lead acid batteries in this kind of locations but you know these are heavy batteries and the damage to these batteries are much more worse than you can think so you can use these uh, AC adapters if you are lucky and you have AC power source there but today in this video I am going to show you how you can make such a small power supply that you can fit in your pocket and it can still supply in between 1.5 volts to 35 volts with voltage control and the current control so let's see how we can build it so to build this power supply you need this DC to DC bug boost regulator now this can take input voltage between 3 volts to 35 volts and output any voltage between 1.5 volts to 35 volts and this voltage regulator has a voltage control current control so it's pretty nice you can control voltage and the current and set the output limit and second you need lithium batteries you can get this from your old cell phones or something kind of like this and to charge your lithium batteries you need this lithium ion charging board which is TP4056 links to buy these parts in the description below so how to build this power supply is very easy you just have to connect the input of this regulator to your battery and you can take output voltage then you need this lithium ion battery charging board connected directly to your battery so the first step clean your battery terminals with some cleaning solution like isopropanol alcohol and then apply the flux to make your soldering job lots of easier then solder your battery terminals these wire strippers are pretty handy to strip these wires like this Thinning these wires can help you a lot in your soldering connections. Use a double sided tape onto the back of this battery charging board to stick it onto the battery. and it's ready okay so we have completed this power supply as you can see it is quite small in size so my battery is uh, almost dead so I think uh, we have to charge this now this red indicator is showing us that it is charging and here is a green LED on to this side so when the battery is fully charged the green LED will turn on so this can output any voltage between 1.25 volts to 35 volts so as you can see there is a very small and fine adjustments you have available you can control your voltage and current using this wheel or you can use this uh, screwdriver to tune out the current and voltage and as you can see that it can start from 1 milliamps and go up to 1.5 amps now additionally you can connect the small panel voltmeters to this power supply to get what is the voltage at this output now additionally I have connected this LED to show the power indicator and I have connected a diode in the reverse polarity here so it can protect our power supply from inductive EMFs with uh, inductive loads. So using this power supply is quite easy you just turn it on and set the voltage output that you want. So now you have this small power supply that you can carry anywhere 
okay so let's pass current through this coil and see and it is flowing the water quite good so this power supply is pretty handy to test this kind of applications here and in this way we can turn on any kind of applications into our remote locations okay friends so tell me your thoughts in the comments down below and check out my other videos subscribe to my channel over here and thanks for watching peace goodbye